and lock the door. They will not let me in. I've been shunned. Did you know that Washington, D.C. has its own version of the Gilded Age, just like the famous HBO TV show? And it's true. Many people are familiar with the extravagant lifestyles and scandals of the New York elite during the late 19th century from the HBO show. But you know about the hidden world of the wealth and the excess right here in our nation's capital. Uh, let's, let's go, go riding, riding through the Gilded Age. This was Mr. and Mrs. Anderson winter residence. The parties that they gave here were the most sought after invitations during the Washington social season. And these people were from old money. So that meant that they were a part of the official society club. Right behind me is the Cosmo Club Mansion, but it used to be owned by Mary Scott Townsend and she was from new money, which meant she was part of the unofficial society. You had to be from old money to be part of society, just like the Gilded Age. Mr. Leader was considered a self-made man, and Mrs. Leader was a former school teacher, but he made massive amounts of money through real estate in Chicago. New money. Before they built one of the largest and most expensive houses in D.C., they stayed here. Mrs. Leader tried to enter into Washington society, but she developed a reputation for having social missteps. And one example was at one of the dinners that she gave, a guest refused to eat her terrapin soup. Mrs. Leader screamed out, you can't refuse my terrapin soup. It costs $100. What? No soup for you. Anyways, eventually, she was accepted into Washington, D.C. society. There we go. Witch house. Got an interesting story. So the Belmonts lived here, and they were snubbed by Edith Roosevelt, President Roosevelt's wife. They were not invited to a party. So the Belmonts decided to throw their own party and invite everyone who was anyone except they did not invite the Roosevelts. Edith Roosevelt was furious, and she wrote letters to all DC society not to invite the Belmonts to any more balls. You went on until Prince of Wales came into town and he decided that he wanted to stay at the Belmont's home because the White House was just a little too small for him. So after that, the Belmont's were accepted into high society. So the creators of HBO got from the hit series Gilded Age, drew a lot of their inspiration from stories from New York, but they could have come to Washington DC to create more captivating storylines. Thanks for watching. And if you like this video, check out this video. This one is about the Gilded Age mansions of New York. So don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more fascinating stories. Hope to see you riding. <laughs>